Hello, in this tutorial we're going to make collectible pickup items. So as we can see, when a player walks into the item, its score increases by one every single time. So let's get started. First of all, I have a simple scene set up with a player game object, which has some basic player movement created in the previous tutorial. So let's start by creating some collectible objects. So let's go to right click, through the object, and I'm going to choose a cube, but feel free to use whatever object you'd like. Press Q. And then we can scale and position it to where we want. Then let's also name this cube to collectible instead. And then on its collider, we set the ish trigger property to true. Then let's go to add component, write collectible. And then go to new script, create an add, and then let's double click collectible and open it up in Visual Studio for editing. Okay, so first of all in Visual Studio, let's get rid of our update method, and instead let's use void on trigger enter. Then we want to check if the object we've collided with has the tag player, which we'll add to our player game object in Unity afterwards. And if it does, then we'll want to disable this collectible game object. So back in Unity, let's come to our player game object and give it the player tag. And then when we hit play, as soon as the player collides with a collectible, it disappears. Now let's make our collectible prefab by dragging and dropping it into the assets folder. And now let's duplicate our collectible and place it around our scene. Okay, so next we want to set up a basic scoring system. So let's come to the hierarchy, right click, go to UI, then text, and then let's import. And then we can see our text game object. Let's name it score text. And then anchor it to the top left corner by holding shift and alt then selecting the top left corner icon. Then let's slightly drag our text in so it's not touching the corner of the screen and we can change the text to something like score. And then on our canvas game object, let's create another script called score manager. And then let's open that up in Visual Studio for editing. Firstly, we want to get a reference to our score text game object. So let's come to the top and add using TM Pro and then serialize field text mesh pro new GUI and let's name this score text. So this serialized field will allow us to drag and drop the text game object into the score manager script from Unity. Underneath let's also create an integer to hold the current score. Then in start, let's set score text dot text to score plus score. Next, let's remove our update method and instead let's create a public void called increase score in which we'll increment the score by one when it's called. Then let's set our score text dot text to score plus score. So great, that's all the code we need for our score manager script. Next let's head over back to collectible one last time and let's create a field for the score manager called score manager. And then in start let's assign score manager game object dot find then the name of our game object was canvas. And then from that game object, let's get component and get the score manager. Then inside of our on trigger enter, before we disable the collectible, let's call score manager dot increase score. So let's head back into Unity. On our canvas game object, let's assign a score text. And then when we hit play, we can see that as a player collides with a collectible, its score goes up.
and with that we've now created collectible items in Unity. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial and I'll see you in the next.